Hello my friends and welcome back to our continued plan let's play The Legend of Dragoon for PlayStation. My name is the Fightless Bird, this is your story based gaming channel, and today we are here in the Valley of Corrupted Gravity. A little change to my party as you can see, I have Albert here. The reason I have Albert in the party is because Rose hit level 17 which means Albert is now behind her. I could sub in Shauna as well. But considering I'm getting addition uh, from fighting normal enemies, uh, Albert is the one who needs them the most over Shauna. Although I do need to bring Shauna back in very soon. I also need to bring in Meru. Problem with Meru though is she doesn't have a dragon spirit and yeah. I did get that one chest on the previous area. And as you guessed, it was an item that prevents instant death. Why do I bring this up? Because this happened in Shadow Hearts as well. Uh, you get instant death prevention in a dungeon and you need to use it on the next boss. The only problem is only one person could have used it and there's um there's only a 33% chance that he hits the and that he hits the character with the instant death prevention. So it's not like something you could really foresee to help prevent the instant death. Uh, what I should have done is I should have just killed the arm that can cause instant death. Because looking back on the video, it's only, it looks like only one body part that does the instant death. Like one arm does instant death, the other arm does that like blasting attack. And it doesn't have a lot of life either. So if I would have just gone after the right arm, or the left arm, I think it's the right arm. One of the arms, I, it probably would have been better. But yeah, we got through it and now we're here. Uh, we are fully healed up as far as mana goes. Uh, I went back and I did pick up some more reviving items. As you can see, and we are ready to go. I hope you're all having a wonderful, fantastic day today. As we uh, continue on here. We are basically on the screen that we left off right after the Raj. I haven't seen these guys a lot. Nice job, Albert. Doing it again. I, I keep... And unfortunately, it summons the rock because... Yeah, as I think Kyle pointed it out, I am correct. It cannot summon the rock unless it's hurt. So by missing a one-hit kill, I I set myself up to get rocked. <laughs> I set myself up to get rocked. Exactly. 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 I also don't think, um, based on what you guys told me, pandemonium does not work on bosses. So there's really no need to try. I'm just going to assume from now on that all repeatable I items that target uh, enemy behavior does not work on bosses. Uh, the time to agility probably does, but the other stuff doesn't. Fully healed, let's go. That did 42 points. Oh wow, he attacked twice. That's great. For addition building. Yeah, 42 points. I think he's leveled up that move. I should probably take a look really quick at additions. Where are we at? Uh, we're at 50 of 60, 35, 40, 61 of 80. Yeah, he just leveled this up recently. Uh, actually, I think he just leveled up in that last fight. And then Gust of Wind Dance is 50 or 60. Okay, time to see what's up the hill. Ready to fight some bandits? I am. Oh. Okay, I wasn't expecting... Home of Giganto? Really? I was expecting a town over here. I was expecting... I was expecting um a, a place full of bandits. Huh. 
So that's now two episodes in a row I've been completely wrong. I was wrong about there being an attack at dinner, and I was wrong about there being uh, an attack after the uh, the Valley of Corrupted Gravity. So this is where, um, what's his, what's his name is from, right? Because he's the Giganto. The really, really big guy. You know, the one that we beat at the end of, uh, at the end of disc one. Okay! Um, fake night shield. Uh, apparently, uh, apparently this is not a nice town. People are trying to kill me. Probably 20 gold. Okay, I'm going out here. I know there was something shining on the left, but I see there's a chest out here. Bandit's ring. That's interesting. What's that do? By the way, how much damage did I take by the arrow? I didn't take any damage. Okay, cool. What does the bandage ring do? Increase agility by 20. Oh, ho, 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 ho. What does that mean? That means you go faster. It means you get more additions. And for someone like Albert, who has a... She has an agility of 70? It's faster than Shauna. Holy cow, if you gave her this ring? Wait, she can't use it. That's weird, she can't use it. Hmm. Well, let's get this Albert. Yeah, I know he's gonna be hitting less, but that agility is really good. Hitting less, but hitting more. Is that more important to me? I think it is. Especially when you have a game that you have to get EXP based on mo using moves. Is it really just one one guy? I'm not even gonna use a magic signal stone because I wanna level up his addition. I'm glad I didn't miss because that would have sucked. I would love everyone to have bandit rings. Like seriously, getting all that speed, especially when you stack it with, um, you know, doubling your agility, uh, you're just gonna be zoom zooming all over the place. It's the mummy of a giganto. There's a small switch. Okay. No idea what that did, but Arrow stop? The arrow stopped. Huh. I turned off the arrows. Bunch of Olmec statues. I sense the enemy's presence. Nope. They're still here. I don't know what you want and how you did you manage to get all the way here. We should play with them a little. Yo, men, don't kill them. That's what the boss said, but why don't we stop them till they stop it being alive? Ha ha ha! Shoot them! Jerks. It's like a Stargate almost. Ah, you thought it would be that easy, huh? Shoot them! Shoot him! Hey, 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 where are you going? Shoot him! All right, all right, I'm gonna... I'm getting tired of being shot at here. I'm getting tired of being shot at. I'm getting tired of all these things on this plane. Darn those devil rats. Yo, brother, take care of them, will ya? Yeah, I got him. It's been a while. I'm, a I'm aching to get him. Let us meet with your boss. We have to talk. There will be no talking. Right around our territory. 
That boots must be from the boot school. Uh, what? I didn't know about that. Well, that's my question. How did you find out about the boot school? <laughs> Who cares if you want to learn about Tesla with me? Well, let's go. Is this a boss? Maybe. Maybe not. Well, let's take out the crafty teeth first. Ha, ha, devil punch. Yeah, let's go for the guaranteed kill. Unless I, um, unless I, uh, you know, you know. Oh, that one hurt. So, how can I tell if it's a boss? Wait, this bird? Oh, it should be a trick. There should be a very easy way to do that. And I'm gonna do it in a second. Nice one hit kill. Hashel's getting the Hashel bean out of him. Um, if he's a boss, this is not going to work. He's not a boss. Okay. That doesn't mean he's not strong. Never mind. <laughs> It doesn't mean he's not strong. Oh, never mind. <laughs> he just did. <laughs> Albert is so, so stupidly strong. God. Run! Yeek! Hey, the rogue school of martial arts is a tradition found only in my village. Oh, the people who use the Vogue South Mass Anime Village must have a connection there. Do you uh, know a woman fighter called Claire? Uh, I don't know any such woman. I learned from my boss Garage. Garage. My boss used to study it seriously, but it was kicked out 20 years ago. Uh, then he became a bandit. Uh, kicked out. Wait, no, I know. That Garage. He must be the man who once was my disciple. He is over there, right? Huh. Yeah, but you cannot defeat my boss. My boss is ten times as strong as me. Huh. It's my face. It decides if I can defeat him or not. I don't know. One on one, I think you would have had a tough time against that guy. We're taking a lot of damage there, buddy. Huh. We're on our way. Uh, what are you doing? I'll show you what the real rogue school is like. Ha! Uh -huh. Falcon Punch! Oh, never mind. Yeah! Ah! Okay, there's the punch. I just did too early. Yo, Hatchel, that was amazing, dude. Reminded me of Fog chomping down a mountain with his sword, although I will say Fog. He may have done it slightly better, but then again, he had that awesome orchestra music behind him. So that kind of put down another tier. Uh, shall we? It was still dang cool, though. Good shot. I mean, just destroyed a mountain with your fist. It seems obvious. There are bandits hiding. Let's start looking here. Can we not get the chest first? What's wrong? I think I did too much. My back hurts. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll be alright if I rest a little. I'll just be over here. Wake me up in uh, 15 days. Ah, man. You should have thought about your age. Like, 
Totally, go ahead. I'll take care of him. Hmm, you will. I think I can wait here by myself. <laughs> no way. You don't know when they will come back? We gotta leave them then. We'll be back if something happens. Hey. Well, if they come back, I'll destroy them. Be good, Hashel. What? Who was that? What was that? Uh, sorry about that. He faked it. He faked all of it just so he could. He could go at him alone. He's probably looking for Claire. He just knocked her out. I guess there are only rock fireflies here. Meru! Guys, it took it that long to look at rock pile flies? What happened? Uh, out. Uh, um, something bumped into me and, um... Oh boy, where's Hashel? Did he go by himself? Alright, well, it's time to get shot at the party, I guess. And, uh, for those who like Meru, again, I will be using all characters. Because I usually like to do that until I get to the point where I realize I need to focus on, you know, two. Uh, by two, I mean two plus dark. The only thing is, until... Until Mary gets a stone, I don't want to use her. I mean, it's kind of that easy. It's kind of that simple. Uh, you only have the therapy ring on, right? 529 HP is not bad. That's more than Rose, right? Or well, almost as much as Rose. So more than Meru. Wow, Meru has a very low hit point total. I mean, Shauna, two levels lower, has almost as many hit, has more hit points than her. Angel's prayer. That would have been useful if I didn't go back to town. I'm glad I went back to town because it definitely looks like there's a boss fight coming. Although, I'm probably going to have to do one more fight first. Just something to weaken me before the fight. Oh, wow. There's a lot of them. Uh, you just attack. Because you can usually take one out one turn if I do everything right. Um, Dart, you're gonna set up a material shield. Surprising, I'll bear one first. That was very lucky. That was not as lucky. But the therapy ring is extremely helpful. Pretty decent at it. No, I'm not perfect at it, but I'm it, it, I'm decent. And if you're wondering, yes, I would replace Dart if I could. Like right now in this party, since it doesn't have his dragon spirit, I absolutely would have replaced him. You jerk! Why is it hard to come by in this game? Got it back. I say dang it because uh, I was hoping to get three level ups on that custom wind dance. But it didn't happen. Alright, let's drop a save here. We have a pretty good party going into this fight. I think so, at least. We have Shauna who needs the experience. Uh, Albert is just great all around. His uh, defensive skill is magnificent. His offense is great. And then we have Dart who doesn't have his Dragoon and it's just Dart. Oh my god, look what it is! 
It's uh the 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 Gagato Congo. That's his name. That just like hit me for some reason. Congo. That's his name. He's here. Hey, I cannot stop laughing, boss. I came all the way here. I guess that pebble I took was super important. There are too many people who don't care about their lives. That's that news from Dano, too. Yeah, let's kill that kid. I don't care if he's the son of the bear. I got that woman with us now. Now is a good chance, because the woman is in control of the palace. It'll be a piece of cake to take over this country. My fist doesn't deserve that kind of thing. I just want to live free. She wants some power. I'll give it to her. But boss, you're gonna be taken to jail. Be no whip like that. Oi, get it. You haven't changed a bit. Who are you? Uh, shut up, you smurfy. What did you say? Boss, is something wrong? Uh, a master. Master at the Vogue School? The uh, head of the bandits. Uh, how low have you fallen? I was ready right to kick you out. Yes, you are right. Thanks to you, I am Team Frito. I'm not the person you remember. Measure this is your heart. When you hit, your fist aches, and your heart aches. Except, it seems that your heart has forgotten the ache. Ah, the dots. Shut up! I'll shut you up! Yeah! Whoa! Nice timing, Dart. Although it would have been cool if Hatchel just like jump kicked him and you like flew into like the next dimension. Anyway, have I kept you waiting? It, it's like not fair leaving me like that. Uh, you. Oh, they just forced Hatchel in our party. Ah, they did. All right, am I bringing out Bear or Shauna? I think I'll bring Shauna, because again, EXP. I, I always think that's important. I don't want anyone to fall too far behind. And uh, boss fights are a great way to get a ton of extra XP. So, yep, we're bringing Shauna in. Even though I don't think she's the best for this combat. Whatever. Well, then why don't you remind me of your so-called aching heart? I love how the other guy like jumps forward. That was cool. That was super cool. All right, so target one's gonna be Mappy, right? Wow. That was an insane amount of HP. And then they attacked again? What the heck is with that game? Alright, uh, I should, uh, um... Hmm... I'm gonna throw a speed up... on... Hashel. And then I am going to... I'm gonna throw a Dragoon up. And I'm going to have you try to take out Mappy as quick as possible. Two hundred fifty-eight damage is two hundred fifty-eight damage. I'll take it. Uh, he's still blue though, and that concerns me. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and throw a healing potion on. I ah, don't need to do that. Oh, wait, she doesn't have any dragoon points. Ah, I thought she was fully built up, and I was gonna transform her and have her heal herself, but I can't do that. Uh, go ahead and do thunder kid again. I mean, that's five hundred damage in the first two turns. That's... I, I think that's pretty decent.
That was a good start. That's a lot of damage, like really quick. And because of it, oh man, he's still blue. How is he still blue after all that? Uh, Shana, I'm gonna have you attack. I need you to get um your dragon form. That way you can pop up for a heal if I need to heal. Especially if he does his BS 500 damage attack. He may only be able to do that though if uh, his friend is on the field. So the sooner we get rid of Mappy, the sooner we'll be better off. Uh, let's have you heal. I know it seems kind of crazy for her to go Drango and just to heal one turn. But this guy really hurts. I would love to do Star Children, but... This guy's attack, but literally takes him one out. And I think that also heals more than a healing push, I'm sure. It does mean, though, that she can't block. So she's going to take full damage if he does that BS move, but... You gotta hope he doesn't do it on her. I'd much rather have you do it on Dart. Dart has HP and defense to... Keep going, even though you do that. Mappy's red. Yes. Light less. And he disappeared. That might have been enough to take him out. That might have been enough to take him out. Always got a dragoon on me. You know, like Palm Hazy Dragoon. You know, jump up and then come down someone. Okay, that did significantly less damage, but still did quite a lot. Oh, there he is. Apparently he just hit for a moment. Apparently he hides and then comes down and attacks. Um, Dart, I need you to heal, because your HP is getting a little low. Shana has got her Dragoon up now. Keep pressing the damage. That's fine. Yes. Go. Double heal. Ha, ha. Double punch. He's almost got his dragoon up again. Please tell me that wasn't a one-hit KO. Please tell me that wasn't a one-hit KO. Mother freaking piece of garbage! Ha, ha. Devil punch. Hate one-hit KOs. Go away. Yes. Go. Instant death Go. sucks. Go. Stop! Doing this and death in games. And why is this guy not dead yet? I've hit him with so much. Ha, ha, devil punch. Finally. Rat bastard. Alright, now we need to pick up Shauna. And then as soon as we pick up Shauna, we need to do a uh, healing breeze. There it is. For some reason I couldn't find it there for a second.
All right, let's do a healing breeze. Uh, let's have you dragoon. Even though I suck at these, especially since you don't get much chance to practice. Why could I only do three? Like I, 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 I could have swore I was pressing on the right spot. Yeah, only did three. Well, that was a lot of damage. She could sort of take right through that though. Good thing she was blocking. I don't understand why I can't do those. Like, it's so hard to do Dragon Rune Forms for some reason. It doesn't seem to be a rhyme or reason why I can't do them either. It's just like, no, you didn't do it. You either press it too soon or too late. I mean, it's gotta be frame perfect, it feels like. Now, I'm sorry, but I'm not a speedrunner. I'm not good at doing things like that. Are you continuing to fend? Dart is getting the heck kicked out of him, quite literally. Uh, Dart, you go into the fence. Sucks that this guy got so many moves in a row. Good thing she was defending. He defend as well. Continue to punch. Punch. Punchity punch punch. punch. Kind of become like a one on one right now. Okay, you're fully healed now. You're getting there. The cool thing is, my heal kills for 91. So whenever he does that, it's it's almost instantaneous get killed back. Okay, just kick actual. I think I can go on the full offensive here. I shall just hit Dragon level two. Okay, Hashel needs to heal. I, I could heal with the uh, Dragon form right now. That way you don't have to waste turns uh, attacking. I can just keep it pressing the advantage with him. He shows up as blue though. Oh, well, he's lost quite a lot of HP. Now, like I said, can continue pressing the attack. We don't need to defend. Chana is also in drag. Uh -huh. Okay, uh, let's say um, it's Fire Star Children. She's about to go un Dragoon and she doesn't need to heal. And firing an arrow is kind of a waste.
I mean, this fight's in the back. Because at this point, I'm not being threatened by anything. We took care of the little guy. So it's just a matter of time. Ah, cinematic punch! <laughs> that was a great punch! I like that. 10 out of 10. Cinematic blows are the best. We actually get a good look at him. I'll smash you! What's happening? Please, run! Master! Wow, Lily smashed him. It's hopeless. All you have to do is just move out of the way. Just take five steps to the left. Oh, let's go! Look at Congo saving our lives. Dude, Congo? Let's go. Let's go. Is he going to join us now? Summon four gods, new edition. And everyone else leveled up as well? Uh, Garage. Now I seem to be helping you remember your ache and your heart to my, uh, fist. <laughs> Will he make it? Barely. Uh, this for now. But if the Gagato over there hadn't saved us, he would be, uh, completely dead by now. Well, in all of us, too. Congo, why are you here? Why did you save us? It's a strange way to get revenge on us. What's going on in your mind? Huh. You, enemy, no more. Yay! He's not an enemy! Here, holy place of Gagatos. Me, survivor. What about the other Kikatos? Human killed us. They stole Kikato's treasure. Human thinks other species can't die. Human selfish creature. That was the reason why you joined the human's war. It's for Emperor Dope. Me still, smug and ran. He saved Congo. He fought against bad people. Congo come with you. So Congo is here. Emperor Do say he make world with every species equal. Will need strong leader. Whether you can be leader. Kago will watch to the end. Kagato's sadness should not be repeated. There is no such world where equal exist. What we have is killing and being killed. That's it. Wow, that's a really narrow mind view. Kill or be killed? Wait. I have my own objectives. I am just continuing my journey towards them. I don't think I make a good leader. You defeat Emperor Dole. Strong, strong power. Stronger than Emperor Dole. Congo wants to see where the power goes. <laughs> Rose is so expressive. Like, that sounds good, doesn't it? The might of Gigantos. Because more people make us feel more secure. Besides, I, I like understand how it feels to be attracted to you, Dart. There must be something wherever you go. Whoa! I still don't know what it is, but like, I want to be with you and do something. Don't you guys feel that way too? 
okay. We are friends now. Huh. For red end. It sounds good. Yay, we did it! I mean, funny if you like pick Dart up in a bear hug and Dart's like, I can't breathe! You have forgotten the most important thing. The stone. Like, come on, we gotta find Lynn. Oh yeah, her too. The dragon spear too. What you are looking for? Maybe down there. You push the thing up there. What, the throne? It's got like a switch or something? Is this it? Oh, cool. Oh, so the top of the the top of the uh, the throne was a staircase. How cool is that? Uh, uh, Garrett, you have come around. I'm glad to receive your first your fist, master. Wait, shut up! Talking makes you die. I gotta tell you this, or I'll die as a real fool. It's about the Princess Emile in the castle. She's a fake. That woman was... What? <laughs> what? Don't say anything. Uh, the real one is hidden in the, the castle. Uh. I'll catch up to you later. I had to attempt him. Me wait here. Bandits may come again. I thought you would join. I thought you were gonna join me. Pressure not back yet. You hurry. Go look. Your important thing. All right. Who's in my party? I seem to love putting Mare on my party. Lynn, where are you? Meru, are you here to rescue me? Of course, Kate's like totally worried about you. Oh no! I I'm letting you out now. This opens it. Good job, out there. If your bond doesn't work, you should use your brain. Like Meru, thanks. Do you know these people? These are my pals. We are traveling together for a variety of reasons. You came all the way to such a dangerous place? What such great people? Thank you. People's courage hasn't dried up yet. Uh you showed it yourself. Like, but why? Did you come alone? I had lots of things to say in the game too. I wanted to solve this by myself. Besides, I thought I might be able to talk to Garrett if he hadn't changed. But something had changed. Part of the person who joined him a year, a half a year ago changed Garrett. And that person is now assuming the form of Princess Emile. We need to go back to the castle, quickly. Well, that's after we find the Stolen Dragoon Spirit. Any stolen goods around should be around here. They were throwing all the stolen items in here. Now let's split up and look for it. Look for Stardust too. It should be somewhere in around this room. 
My logic will not work in locating it. Don't mind me. Ew, these are all wine barrels. Oh, I see a glimmer. Are you really trying? Yeah, I am, but I want to talk to everyone first and look for uh, Stardust. I I Stop telling me, are you really trying? I, I am trying. It should be easiest for you to find it because the red-eyed rec dragon recognizes you. Is that why it's flashing like that? It's a mummy of a giganto. Oh, look, there's a Stardust. No, there's not. Man. We had to find it as soon as possible because it's a very important memento. Yeah, I know, and I need to get my dragoon form powered up. I got it! Like, wow! It seems happy to meet you again. Quiet the Red Eye Dragon Spirit! Yes! Now let's go back to Flood since he puts his Lisa and tell her everything. Did you find the thing? Wait, well, it seems you found both Lean in the Dragon Spirit. in our party and he's level 19. I, I think they start the level you are and I'm much higher level than everyone else. So that's why that happens. Oh my god, look at that HP total. He is a behemoth, which you would expect, right? Uh, well, unfortunately though, he is the highest level and just like Mario, he doesn't have a Dragoon Spirit. And until I find a Dragoon Spirit, there's really no reason to use him, which sucks. Uh, let's put in Rose and... Albert. Summon four gods. It's a three edition. Uh, base 50 SP, damage 100. So more SP than Floria sticks, but a lot, much, a lot less damage. Gus wins almost level four. And he only has three additions, surprisingly enough. That's really weird. I think Rose has, what, four? Yeah. Only had three is kind of weird. Uh, but again, I can't use him until, you know, until other people, uh, until he gets his spirit, which sucks because I'm probably not going to get his spirit for a long time considering Meru joined before him and I haven't had uh, Meru's dragon spirit yet. So that's, uh, that's kind of lame. That is kind of lame. Um, hmm. So, you're almost level 4, which is good. You have ways to go, and this is almost a level 5. So, let's keep you on double punch until you get there. Do I have to run all the way out? I think I do. I meant to press triangle on the save point, and I completely missed the save point. I like ran into something. Save on the Gagata home. All right, so what I'm gonna do is we're gonna go with each other to uh, the beginning of this area. It shouldn't take too long. Normally when you leave an area, there's a good chance for a story to happen. Oh look, new enemies. Wow, look at those swords. They hurt a lot. Oh my gosh, berserkers. Yes. Wait a second, did I say that I was going to finish Hatchel's uh, moves? I think so. Why is he not in the party right now? Why is Hatchel not in the party? Oh my god! Where did that come from? I mean, they are called berserkers, but jeez louise! Oh, bear, what the heck was that, man? 
I haven't seen numbers like that the entire game so far. Not even close. I mean, I think Final Burst, uh, whatever, uh, Darts Attack did like 400 damage to a guy, but dang, out there? That was nuts. I mean, I could just use this party for now. I do want to get Hatchel that class three. Uh, but then again, I did use him and Rose a lot on the way here, so it might be time to switch out. These guys are so weird. It's like something out of Legend of Zelda or something. What's weird is everyone else I've done level one editions first and then I've worked my way down. For some reason with Albert, I just went straight to level the, the fourth edition. I just been leveling that. I have no idea why that is. And he's down. That's fine. Okay, so nothing happened on the way out. Which is really weird. I mean, I guess they want us to go fully back to the castle. But I was expecting something to happen. You know, on the way back. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I don't know why I thought that. I've been wrong every single time I try to predict something in this game so far. Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm shooting like offers all around. So should I go ahead and stop here, perhaps? I think that's a very good possibility. Yeah, it looks like I'm just heading back to the castle, so... Let me go ahead and stop here. There's no reason you guys didn't see me run all the way back castle. I know we're only at like 53 minutes or so. Shorter episode than normal, but in the next part we will... We'll go to Castle Flex. And uh, we'll be ready to do that storyline like right from the get-go. Uh, before we go, I do want to say, uh, I do want to say thank you to Fleeting Day, uh, who has been posting on the channel about this game and recently has become a Patreon supporter, which I, 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 oh man, I, I don't, I don't know what to say except thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so very much. I'm, I'm just blown away by by the fact that you're here and the fact that you choose to support me in that way is just it, it's unbelievable and um uh thank you thank you so very much from the bottom of my heart it means a lot to me uh as well as thank you to everyone else who support me in that way and thank you for everyone who just watches the videos uh comments on the videos likes the videos uh subscribes to the channel you know when uh when i saw this channel four years ago it was never my intention to grow instantly and that's never happened but the idea is you know with all of your support i can grow over time and over time i've seen growth and i've i, I can't do it without you guys you are the number one youtube community in all of youtube and i mean that from the bottom of my heart and i always mean that you i can't tell you how much you guys have changed my life in a positive way so thank you so much i love you all I love you all so, so very much. And I hope you guys have a wonderful, fantastic, amazingly awesome day. As well as a good week if you're watching this live. And yeah, I'll see you guys again very soon. Until then, so long. And take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved. And you should always be true to yourself Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.